Hey everyone, happy Saturday! Woo! <laughs> How's it going everyone? Uh, yeah, you know, uh, thanks Shipwreck for finding that bug. Um, hey Justin. Uh, usually Justin finds the bugs, but uh, Shipwreck, so... The bug was, I think you responded, when you hit exclamation mark join, you were responding to uh, Greggle's uh, message like a previous message that Greggles had made. And so I put, I put the example in the discord. If you want to go check it out, um, there is, there is a lot of metadata that comes with, uh, each message. And if you reply, there's a whole, like who you're replying to and all this other stuff is in there, including like, it's like it said like parent user ID. And so basically what it was doing was it was parsing looking for the looking for the term user ID. And the first one it found was parent user ID. And it used Greggle's user ID to look up the data. But the display name was yours. So we had a case where you were basically using Greggle's data. And that's like eh. Because actually, y'all were both playing with the same data at the same time. And so actually, what, what it was doing is y'all were like saving over each other as you were playing. <laughs> so it was like, it was, it was wild. It was wild. Um, but we got it all cleared up. Um, and uh, I, I put a fix in, I put a patch in, which was put to put a, a semicolon in front of user ID to make it unique. I had no idea that when you responded, that would be in there and therefore it caused that bug. I was worried that uh, it was random. I hate random things. Random is hard to, to um, it is hard to fix. But I went back to the VOD and I looked at the chat. It's great that I have the chat here. And the chat had, um, it had Greggles, it said at Greggles, uh, and then exclamation mark join for you. And I was like, oh, he responded somehow to a message. And I bet you I know exactly where it was. It only actually took me about five minutes to fix once I saw uh, what it was. So but anyway, I thought it was quite interesting and, and, an, and an easy fix. And now it's all patched up. And so that shouldn't happen again. But who knows? That's been in there. Well, it's been in there since this version because I switched to using user IDs versus usernames. Wouldn't have happened in the old code when I was just using usernames. However, user ID is better to use because let's say you go and like you changed your name at one point. And uh, if you change your name, then I can't find you anymore. And I had to go in and manually fix it. So, so anyway. <laughs> I miss working on Fry's Quest. I need to work on Fry's Quest. So maybe I'll find some time to work on, on it and fix up the... I was working on the hair so you could change the character's hair and stuff like that. So maybe I need to continue working on that. I think you must have done that. You must have been in the middle of responding to to uh, one of his messages. And then you were like, oh, it's time to play Fry's Quest. Wiped it out and then typed join. And that's probably what happened. So. <laughs> it's no big deal it's cool i'm glad I, i'm glad you found it um and it wasn't so bad like i said i was worried it was something much more like insidious <laughs> like oh my god this has been happening the whole time and i've never known and it was really just that one event that was doing it so that made me feel better because there have been a few bugs that are just like uh like uh like, you know, because I don't close Fry's Quest, it's still actually running. And that allows you to at any time do, do like stats and stuff like that. So it's basically, uh, it's like a little bot program running on my machine uh, when you're, uh, when it's not being played. <laughs> no, I mean, well, I guess the, the, what happened was, yeah, we had two people playing Greggle's character, basically. And I don't know who ended up with it. If it's whoever would have saved last somehow, so I don't know. I don't know what happened really. But we remember we checked the data in last night's uh, stream, and 
Scruggles was okay with the changes, so we just kept going. <laughs> oh, thanks for following! Yeah, exactly! Was it was it you tearing off your mask, or was it was it, yeah it wow that looks like shipwreck, or is it oh no, it's Greggles, it's two there's two Greggles! <laughs> Well, I don't know if you wanted that character because it was lower level than your current character, right? So that wouldn't have been good. <laughs> but yeah, I need I need to continue. I haven't worked on Fry's Quest in a while, and it was fun cracking it open and working on it today. So I need to get back into it. You know, it's just sometimes it, I just, oh man, life. <laughs> life gets in the way sometimes. But I really do enjoy working on it, so... Um. <laughs> exactly multiple <laughs> exactly um ah, well you know tears it seems like well, here we are on the fourth stream of tears of the kingdom and i feel like i haven't gotten anywhere so hey con reverso how's it going um so yeah i mean let's just let's hop right into it as always we can take a break and play a game like ooh, that looks like centipede off of the arcade machine it does not have to be centipede it can be any of the games on the arcade list and if i beat the high score i'll put your name on the high score list um i don't i don't know if i pointed this out i i hooked up the ps1 is now ps1 and the ps4 which you can't really see because it's black um again i can make the joke here's my ps5 it's a four and a one together uh, but this is getting ready for Spiro, and this is getting ready for Last of Us Part Two, and so I c I can at least put this in and then switch out the top one. So <laughs> true, Justin. Even after the pinned message of no backseating, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I was gonna I you know you put that meme up, which is totally true, and I was actually gonna respond saying you know uh, <laughs> what was I gonna say? Oh, go. Go, you need to be doing Colony 9 uh, uh, <laughs> side quests. <laughs> so, anyway. <laughs> Alright, let's play. <laughs> oh, well, I thought a good response, a good response would have been, I wasn't in denial. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't in denial. <laughs> I was intentionally doing it. <laughs> no, it's cool. It's cool. I get, you know, I get, I get, um, the passion. You know, I know people love games and gaming, and I love interacting with everyone. So. It just don't, you know, just don't be too bushy or too uh, spoilery. Um, I like when people ask, hey, do you want a, do you want a suggestion or something like that? I'm, I'm fine with me. Although I do just love, <laughs> I love just stumbling through games, so... An uplifting device. I mean, has, you know, I mentioned that pl building things has been really fun in this game. Ah, hot air balloons. They're showing you hot air rises. So what if I were to... Can I even grab that one that's already... I guess I could. And then just set it right here. Oh no, I didn't mean to attach it. Oh no! Bye. This is why they give you multiple ones.
Oh, it, it stopped. I was curious what would happen when it reached the ceiling. Anyway. <laughs> that, that was... <laughs> exactly. Hey, Kruggles. You, you missed you, you missed us talking about uh, uh, Fry's Quest. I fixed that bug from last night. I'm going to take this and just set it near it. Do not attach it. So now can I get on? Can I get in it? What do you want me to play? Splatterhouse? All right, cool. I shall play Splatterhouse. So am I supposed to get on it? Oh, well, maybe I could. Oh, I know what I could do. What if I were to attach? Like, uh, let me let me solve the shrine and then we'll play some spot. Do not attach it. Nope, nope. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, no, no. <laughs> until, until it's totally, uh, yeah. <laughs> Katara. Uh, yeah, exactly. Oh, is there, there is a limit, huh? Oh, no, no. I want to get... Stop. Oops. I may just have the same problem. Oh my god! It's on fire! It's on fire! Oh, it, it burned up! Well, let's get I'm not on that. Hmm. <laughs> well, this has been fun. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to um going to do a little something a little bit different. So this time we are going to Do I have a torch? I don't know if I have a torch. I like that stick though. All right, here, let's, um, what if I, what if I dropped? <laughs> Always looking to, uh, get longer things <laughs> I just wanted to light it Without fusing, uh, well, I hit I hit the B button instead of the A button would be would be a good idea.
being up here. Oh, look, there's my balloons. The first two attempts. Why am I up here? Well, it was kind of tilting to the side, you know. It wasn't, it wasn't the greatest balloon in the world. I think that what the deal with this game is that it just takes... Um, it just takes time to kind of figure out these puzzles sometimes. Alright, so we got more balloons. Hmm. Hey, Leon, how's it going? I mean, I assume I can get over here and get my balloons. Bye. Well, I don't know how why that really matters. Hmm. <laughs> I still I feel like I don't know what the intended solution is on anything. Hmm. I can think of. <laughs> why can't I just light it? Oh, there goes the balloon again. Oh look, we've got a perpetual motion machine going on now. Because it's near the torch. I thought maybe those had something to do. Oh, is there... Yeah, it's basically proximity. Oh, I see. It's a button. I see. I thought it was... I thought it was... Um, okay, I get it. I thought it was saying, go, uh, go through here, but it's an actual button. Yeah. I'm like, I've already done all this. <laughs> hey, Matthew J. in the hole again. Who 
Who put together these shrines? <laughs> okay, that's where we gotta get a ball in there. See the balls down there. Oh, we have to get one in each. No ladders. <laughs> oh. Ah. <laughs> Shit. Right. Okay, we got some balloons. Got some. Oh, wow. Can I just like uh, pick up the ball? Yeah, pick up the ball. Yeah. I don't want to necessarily do what I did before. <laughs> That's what she said. Oh, see, I can't grab it while well, I hate I hate this. I think we encountered this last time, right? Here, I'll just attach it. And then I can and then I can pick it up. We'll put it in the middle. For weight distribution. Actually, you know what? I shouldn't put it in the middle because I'm going to stand on it. I don't know if that's a good idea either. Be balls. <laughs> All right, I have a torch. No, I just want to hold it out. Why can't I just hold out the torch? Without, without strike, without striking it. Oh shit! Oh, I see a problem. I see a problem. Or maybe not. Maybe I I need to get it caught on the roof. Here's the problem. <laughs> Alright, that was the problem. <laughs> up, up and away in my beautiful balloon. Oh shit! It fell over! Oh no, I got a fire! Oh shit! Oh, oh, we're back into perpetual motion machine. What if, um. <laughs> Great. Great. Oh, what is this? Like, oh, these are like, oh, I can pick those up. What if I, oh yeah, what if I pick one of those up and just set it right here? <laughs> I knocked it over. No, 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 I don't want to attach it. Oh, I guess I could attach it. Oh, shit. No, no, don't rotate it that way.
Oh no! Oh no! Oh man, I'm having way too much fun with this. Way too much fun. <laughs> well, there is a ceiling. <laughs> way too much fun with the building aspects of this game. Yeah, one of these days we're going to do arcade mode. I haven't forgotten. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> that. Hey, just like that. Yeah, I think they did that intentionally. Oh. That's the end of the shrine, right? I don't want to end the shrine. I want to see what's in this one. Hell yeah. It's a, it's a chest. I'm going to be upset if it's nothing big. It's like it's no big deal. Okay. So, let, let's go back up. Okay, I'm going to try not to die. Go back up. Oh, I guess I don't need to go back up. It's just we're just gonna leave that at the top, and we're just gonna pick one. Up. There. Then let's take the big. I can. I assume I can take the big ball. Yeah. Oh. I can move. Oh, I see. Helps if you read. Alright, let's set it. We're gonna set it next to it. And then... How are we lined up? about this. It'd be better if I lined it up there. I have a design in mind. Alright, so then let's grab this thing. I'm gonna fuse it to the top of the ball. Oh no, the ball's moving. No! Shit! Oh no, the ball is moving. What, what have I done? Okay. My problem is here. Let's unstick it real quick. I think my problem was I didn't get it s stuck in the in like the the middle. Yeah. Shit! Don't! No! 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 Ah! That was close. I like how I crouched. All right. So maybe maybe attaching the the. The thing, the ball, is not a good idea. I thought it was a great idea. Uh, 
let's do this. Oh shit. No. I mean, the problem is, is it's round, right? Did I, I, I think I burned up all my platforms. Oh wait, no I didn't. Look at that. Fancy. Now, now I'm going to stand on it. Let's go. Let's go. <gasps> why aren't we going? Oh my God. Why aren't we going? Am I too heavy? Uh, pr probably not. <laughs> I I have a feeling there's just gonna be shit in that in that chest, and this I've I've done this all for nothing. But you never know; it could be something nice. Oh, it's stuck there. Interesting. Come to me. <laughs> oh, it could be. Could be. It's, um, it could be. It could be. Neil, Neil, we need Neil here. He knows all that. He's the music person. Oh, I knew it was just going to be a fucking opal. Fine. Better be worth be a lot of rupees. <laughs> Let's say that my uh, solution was quite unique. I'm sure Neil would be in here going, oh my god. Hey, but that's the fun of it, right? So imagine, you know, 
all you know the problem I had with Fry's Quest, and then such an open system that they that they devised with all that stuff, having to QA all of that, right? <laughs> yeah, Greggles, if you if you didn't catch the top of the stream, I I found the problem with Fry's Quest. Everything's over in the Discord if you want to go check out what the problem was, and it has been fixed. All right. Shipwreck, what did, which game did you want me to play? I've completely forgotten now. Splatterhouse, that's right. Shipwreck. TTV. Wants me to play Splatterhouse in our gamer! <laughs> I haven't played Splatterhouse in a while. It's um, it's it's really popular at Halloween. <laughs> um, yeah. There's the score we're trying to beat, thirty-seven one hundred. Basically, you're uh, Jason from Friday the Thirteenth. Which I don't know how they got uh, permission to do that. Or they're like, oh, it's not Jason. It's just a killer in a hockey mask. Ba -ba 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 -ba. There it is. Splatterhouse. But it's an interesting, it's an interesting game. All right. 37,100. <laughs> Have you not seen Splatterhouse? Yeah, it's it's an interesting game. All right, let's do it. What what attracted you to this game? The blood. <laughs> ah, okay, cool. Yeah, look, see the hockey mask. Ooh, I've come to life. right at the end.
right at the end. Ah. Uh, I mean, yeah, obviously a horror, horror based uh, video game, right? my stick. Five seven hundred. Not a bad, bad for uh, first time back at it. <laughs> oh, oh well. I was supposed to be a K. <laughs> All right, shall we do it again? I, I can do better. Um, but I have to kind of finish that one level I was on in order to beat that score. So, all right, let's do it again. It's interesting that you remember the game from a comic book way back in the day, too. Spoopy. <laughs>
we go. <laughs> bubble bobble ads. I think I remember bubble bobble ads. Welcome, everybody. Welcome, we're playing a game off the arcade machine. Give me just a second. Thank you so much for the raid! Welcome, Jay! Uh, we're in the middle of Splatter House, so give me just a second. a weird level. Jason from Friday the 13th was so susceptible to, uh, to, uh, like chairs falling on him. <laughs> Thank you so much, Jay. Welcome. What were you up to? What were we up to? Playing Final Fantasy 16? Nice. I haven't, you know, I, the only Final Fantasy I have played, and I played it on stream, was the first one on the NES, which is above my head right there. <laughs> so, so one of the things I do about my channel is I try to play like all the games in the series before playing the, the, the most recent one. And so you'll see today we're playing Tears of the Kingdom. So what does that mean? Yes, I have actually played all of the Legend of Zelda games. Even the CDI games, although we didn't play all of them, uh, on on the stream. And uh, yeah, we're finally getting around to Tears of the Kingdom. Better than 15. Which one was the online one? Was that 14? Because I'm definitely not playing the online versions of Final Fantasy either. That doesn't. 
Here's the king as well. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I started Octopath, the first Octopath Traveler. In fact, I was, so I recently organized all of my games and uh, I was going through my uh, Switch games and I didn't realize I have Octopath Traveler. <laughs> yeah, 14 was online. Cool. Well, thank you so much. Um, yeah, so we were we were playing um, playing Tears of the Kingdom, but we're also I was playing Splatterhouse for uh, for shipwreck on the arcade machine, and I did not beat the high score shipwreck, but uh, I have to get past that house, which I have gotten past that house before. Uh, the the haunted room, you have to you have to the things fall and you have to avoid them, and then the chair you have to kill the chair, then the knives you saw the knives, and then you have to punch the knives. It's a weird it's a weird game oh, i realize an ad is in progress yeah i'm gonna is it okay if i play a clip those pesky ads It's better to play them. It's funny how they have it set up so it's better to play them during the stream than as pre rolls. But let's, uh, we're gonna play a clip from Jay. I wanna say Jay Knate. <laughs> I wanna, I wanna, I wanna pronounce the eight already following you cool yeah yep all right ad should be over ah okay got it yeah, cool. Well, I, I looked and I was already following you, so it's okay if I play Kip? Alright, cool. That was. I saw that the ads... Quest before and I look at that, it, it's Final it's Fantasy 16. Nice. Yeah, thanks again, Marvel. Enjoy the lurk. Thanks for being here. Thanks for the nine months of following. I think I saw that um, when uh, either you or Josh or somebody pulled it up, so thank you. All right. No, it doesn't. Whole... Oh, yeah. Interesting. How are you liking Final Fantasy 16? I have so far to go before I get to Final Fantasy 16. <laughs> so far to go. And it, and it didn't get... It didn't get on the... Uh, through 12. <laughs> I mean, here's here's the games that uh, everyone voted on. Uh, not uh, not all of them are, were voted on that I'm going to be playing. So, of course, Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, uh, Spyro the Dragon. Um, so, I've been trying to finish all the Castlevania games. So, remember, you know, playing all the, all the games in a series. There are 26 Castlevania games, and we're down to the last two. Uh, Mirror of Fate on the 3DS... And then we're going to play Pokemon Black 2. I'm in the middle of playing all the Pokemons. Not all of them. Every generation. Um, then the final Castlevania game, Lords of Shadow. Actually, Lords of Shadow was actually a pretty good game. Very reminiscent of um, uh, uh, God of War. Last of Us 2 and Sonic the Hedgehog. So that's, that's all the games. That's my stack. My newly voted on stack. Oh, and there's also, you know, I'm missing... Uh, I don't have a box for Fallen Order, so I'm going to be playing Jedi Fallen Order as well. Um, that's that's my list of games. It'll be a while before I finish them. It takes me... Depends on how long they are. Um, but it's been taking me maybe three months to finish a, a stack. We do them in stacks of eight. Maybe three or four months, depending on... Like, Xenoblade Chronicles took forever. <laughs> it took, that took a whole month just to play Xenoblade Chronicles. And so, and this one, I have a feeling it's going to take a while too. 
All right, let's. Uh, thanks again for the raid. We're gonna get back to playing a couple more games of Splatterhouse and seeing if I can beat that score right there, thirty-seven one hundred. So, see how it all begins. First, a hockey mask floats through the air, and then there's a dead body, and then it inhabits Jason. <laughs> All right, thanks again for the raid. And thanks for the lurk. got through there but barely i don't know why I, it's funny how previously i was doing great on that level and then it's on all of a sudden i was like dying all the time
<laughs> I jumped right into the chair. Killed by the painting! I was killed by the painting. <laughs> what the hell? Timed out right on the K. All right. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's play one more game and then we will take a, uh, a break. All right. Let's play one more game. <laughs> this has been a crazy game. I survived. <laughs> I survived. I, I want to get past that haunted house room. Oh, my God. 
Both came at me at the same time. Still killed by the pitcher. <laughs> Close to thirty five four. All right. Uh, we're going to play some Fry's Quest. Uh, for those of you who came in with the raid, Fry's Quest is a chat 
driven uh, RPG. And so you do exclamation mark join to have a little character that you are leveling up. Basically, you find uh, three rounds of monsters, get more gold, get more uh, experience points, all that jazz. There isn't really a good spot to hide from that painting, that rogue painting. <laughs> anyone else wants to join or if you played last round you have to wait 34 more seconds until the the timer gets down to one minute that's how we because only eight people can play at a time that's how we kind of like give it so that other people can play um you don't have to play you're actually gaining experience points by just watching as well and uh and then but you do have to play in order to level up so you have to get you have to get what's called golden fries in order to level up so yeah, so Greggles, what was basically happening was both you and Shipwreck were playing your character last time. You both had the same user ID, and it was because of a bug, and he responded to a message of yours when he did exclamation mark join. And so that was the bug. But I was glad, I was glad it was easy to figure out. I was just watch the VOD and looked at chat. And when I saw it said at Greggles Wong exclamation mark join, I was like, what? <laughs> what? And it was easy to figure out what was going on from there. But yeah, details are over on the Discord if, if anyone's interested in uh Rise Quest. And uh as I as I work on it, I I I put stuff in that channel. That's pretty I I think it's kind of interesting. Of course, because I'm programming it. So, so, of course, I think it's interesting. <laughs> All right. It's a single player game. All right. I'll see you in a second. Welcome to Neil's Deals. Where else you gonna go?
ready for battle. Have fun storming the castle. to Neil Steele's. We're not satisfied until you're not satisfied. Ready for action. Give him hell, kiddo. <laughs> wow. It, I, you know, <laughs> I thought that was funny, Jason.
drama. <laughs> that, that's you. <laughs> well, I will probably book my flight today, Justin, for uh, for uh, TwitchCon in October. <laughs> it is! It is nice, isn't it? There are a variety of monsters in this game. <laughs> but then Fl uh, Flaming Baguette shows up and it's all golems. <laughs> yeah, I was just kind of waiting. I don't know why. Yeah, yeah. It says, it says buy now because it's going to go up. So I'm like, okay, I'll buy now. Scorpio, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Y'all did it. <laughs> I was getting worried there for a second. Don't let the jelly get you at the end. <laughs> Crackle's got the fry. See, that's one, also one way to make sure that you that you get a fry is uh, to have less people. <laughs> Do I need a nay now? Nay. Speaking of nay, let's get on our horse. How do I? Hold on. Oh, it's good to have spicy peppers. I think we were heading... Were we heading that way? I am now not heading the right direction. Now I want to head... That way. I want to head the opposite the direction I'm heading. I have. That's where... This is my... This is my horse from... Uh, from the last game. Oh, but she, you know what? She needed some wild horses, so we're going to get these right here. Yeah, so this is, this is Epona from Breath of the Wild. My Epona. My Epona. I was remembering how to sneak. Pretty though. <laughs> How do I say that? <laughs> yeah, since I um oh fuck. <laughs> uh since I uh you know I replayed Breath of the Wild more recently. I guess it's been a while um, for the stream, and so but I still had him.
There we go. Uh. <laughs> Did you catch this angel for me? It's just what I pictured perfect for pulling my wagon. It's all yours. <laughs> huh? You mean that? You'd really part with such a wonderful horse? Uh. Thank you. Wow, who knew stuff like this really happened? Go so happy. I'll just go ahead and put a harness on it. Hi. Harness is a piece of equipment that you can put on horses you own. With a harness, you can connect uh, your horse to a wagon or item you need to take somewhere. Collect enough pony points, you can get one as a prize. So bear with me a moment. Are you going to give me some pony points? <sighs> and we're all set. Oh. I can't believe it. A wagon of my own and a beautiful horse to pull it. I think I started with an old piece of junk and ended up with this... <laughs> Amazing. Thank you so much. Here, it's all I have left after buying the wagon. I'm begging you, no forcing you to take it, please. That's good. 100 rupees. That's pretty good. Oh, that's right. There's one last order of business. What's your name? Uh. Link? Hmm. Zumi. Link. Maybe it's Zuli or Lumi. Oh my god, she's trying to marry me. Or what about Zunk? Oh, she's trying to name the horse. <laughs> I thought she was trying to, to figure out our celebrity name, like Benifer. I'll call the, the wagon Zunk. <laughs> I promise to look after Zunk for as long as I live. <laughs> Feel free to come visit the two of us anytime. <laughs> hey, look, I did a side quest, Justin. As you should be. There's where we're headed. called skill my friends he turned into raw meat Is that who I think it is? It is! Jalaka! Oh, he's worried. He's scared. Those trees over there. So scary. Sh Shalaka. Yeah, they are pretty scary. Hestus's, <laughs> Hestu's concerns. Alright, what about him? Giant broccoli. That's what we used to call them. Oh, wait. I don't want this. I want an axe. Do I have a big axe? Don't. Oh, this is a big axe. Ow. Yeah. 
<laughs> I like how you chop them down and, and they become uh, logs. Jalakala? The scary things are gone? I want him to get his maracas out again. Oh, he's got him out. <laughs> you see me. You see me. My name is Hestu. I'm the musician of Koroko Forest. Up northeast, I'm known for my maracas and my dancing. <laughs> well, yeah. Well, we saw the trees moving in the last stream. And I was like, what? Thanks for your help. Cha shaka To show my appreciation, I'll do a little dance for you and make your pouch bigger. Thank God. But my maracas aren't working anymore. The Kuroko seeds inside are all gone. How am I supposed to dance now, Shoko? The children of the forest must have taken them again. If I had even one Kuroko seed, I could sing and dance and use my powers to help you. Well, I have I have plenty of them. <laughs> Uh, but the seeds spilled all over the place when I broke my maracas, and I think the children of the forest took the seeds while I was in a panic. <coughs> sniff! I have four of them. Hang on! Sniff, sniff. Do you have Koroko seed? You do? You got a Koroko seed from one of the forest children? If you give me a Koroko seed, uh, Korok seed, I'll make your inventory bigger. <coughs> Shalaka! So which stash do you want slots in? Weapon. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, he's got helpers this time. <laughs> well, cool. It was better last stream. Wait a second. You still have more seeds? I smell them. Yes. Um. I mean, let's do weapons again. <laughs> I don't know. That's a good question. He had maracas in the last game. He can smell your seed. And that's what Murray says when he first appears. Speaking of smelling your seed, here's Murray! <laughs> I've got to get a move on. I'll be heading east soon. Okay. Let's dance together. I don't know if we're going to dance together, but... Don't make me walk over there. Oh, I forgot that the trees drop their nuts. You're drunk and full of meat. Okay. No comment. Monster extract. A result of Kilton's research into monsters. This suspicious spice can be used to punch up dishes while cooking. Hmm. Oh my goodness, that scared the shit out of me. It created a pine cone though. Get out of here, dude. Ah. Oh, sorry, I, I whipped you too much. How we get up here? Oh. Huh. 
good, it cleared up. Yeah. <laughs> what do we got here? much. What do we got? What do we got in our inventory? We got a wing device. We got a portable pot. We got some flame emitters and we got a fan. I mean, I could just kind of not overthink this and just get out of here. Hold on, I've just sit here and used up all my stamina. Like, let's not overthink this. Let's just climb. Yeah. Have a good one, Murray. This is kind of funny. What is that? I don't want to miss it. Did 
The birds are like, this is no big deal. Ah, those are nice. Gloom. that Orange Island that means <laughs> is this like Superman Is that a shrine? Interesting. Welcome. This is the site of a ceremony to test your courage. Courage is demonstrated by diving headlong in through the sky. No challengers have revisited this island in a long time. I'm glad you have come. Witnessed your dive earlier. You seem to have come prepared. Now then, let us commence with the dive ceremony. Are you prepared? Could it be that you do not know of the dive ceremony? My apologies. Allow me to explain. The dive ceremony is a trial that tests your courage. It is a rite by which Sonai youth come of age. The starting position in the sky island is far above here. Okay, I've already done this. Challenger leaps from there. They must pass through all the rings in a set of amount of time. I wish you luck in your formidable overcome. Yeah. I mean, dude, I've already done it. You should have known. You should know that I already did it. Oh, it's a thing. I mean, I don't really think I need any, but... bombs and explosion oh good a balloon I wouldn't mind trying to get more balloons oh shit I need to do that Let's do this.
Oh, yeah, yeah. You can put the little spike things in, too. But they were saying that the charges are the best to put in. So. Archery. Yes, I know about this. This is the same as Breath of the Wild. No, it helps. I should use my, um... Uh... <laughs> I can't remember what. My amiibo, that's what I was trying to think of. Boom. Yes, I have proven my mastery. This is gonna give me a good bow. Are those all my arrows? Oh, it has some arrows over here. I figured it would give you. Pretty good bows. <laughs> Thank you, Techno. Is it Techno Panda? You go by. I'm gonna drop this one. Brand new bow. Uh, I think that's the same thing I just picked up. Oh well. How are you doing on this Saturday? <laughs> he can't, can't see you, though. Oh, a strong bow.
awake. I lost my horse. <laughs> Show on the map. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> He's way over there. Okay, I'll go back and get him. Doing well. Hey, Delphonic Star. Just a lazy Saturday afternoon. Of course. I'm always worried that I'm gonna hit the birds. The best kind of Saturday? That's true. Actually, let's drop the torch. God. Torch on the end of a sword. Kind of like putting torches on the end of things. Oh, thank you. <laughs> da, da, da. All right. I'm afraid, though, that my horse is way past that ridge. Oh, I see. It's up on that ridge. Oh, yeah, I see. See what I have done. Did you travel to that point? Yeah, yes, I already, I already, I got over here because I, um, well, I landed on a, on a thing, and then I, uh, did the shrine up, up in the sky, and then I, uh, then I landed here. Yeah, it's funny, this is like the one part of the map now. Yeah. 
<laughs> I can't say that I know anyone in Italy. Oh wait, I, I think I have at least one Facebook friend in Italy. Get him. I don't need his arm. What's that over there? What is that? What is that? Oh, it's a snail. Didn't seem very sneaky to me. Must just be a name. Uh-oh. These are the things you said you didn't like. I instantly killed it. Yeah, they're not hard to kill, but I, I do not like them. Well, like it started shaking, and so I'm like, oh. Well, so there you... Uh, Usually they start uh, hitting rocks at me before. Yeah. Well, there was always... It's historically been a, uh, a way to... Like, you use, usually use your shield against them, basically. Well, what I was complaining about is that I got tricked to the top of one. Um, Are you close enough to your mic? Because it's cutting in and out. Is that better? Yeah. What I was saying is I got tricked by one of those because the top of it was a trunk. Ah, uh, it was a trunk. So I went trying to like pull it out of the ground. <laughs> and then it popped out? And then it popped out and shot rocks at me. <laughs> I'm like, ah, screw you. <laughs> yeah. American style. I don't know if it's American style, but yeah, I get what you're saying. You're just saying they're kind of few and far between in Italy. I think... Oh, that's not my horse, but that is a horse. I, that's what I say. I think that, too. I, I have a feeling there's got to be some. They're in hiding. They're in hiding. Hey, Pocket Bear. going well. I've got a claymore with a torch on the end of it. I'm trying to get back to my horse. That's the downside of gliding. It's over here somewhere. There he is. Lee and Shroom. <laughs> Too few bears. <laughs> All right, we want to go that way. I'm worried that it's a little too rocky this way, but we're going to try anyway. Yep. Yeah, this is my horse from uh, Breath of the Wild. Oh look, there's another shrine. We should probably head that way. Here, let's stop. I've got I've got some uh got some stuff to do. Ooh, the herb. Gotta pick up the herb. So, can I... Can I do the eyeball from here? You have two Eponas? It's weird at this picture that you posted. 
started streaming. Because it's way more light than it's ever in this room. Oh. <laughs> well, I was over in the corner there. Oh, he fell asleep. Oh no. He's on fire. Oh no, he fell. <laughs> all right. No, you don't have. You didn't bother me at all. All right. Have a good one, Techno Panda. Ooh, can I get the meat? I think so. Yep, I did. That's pretty good. I guess we can just go ahead and drop this thing that's about to break. Um... What was I thinking? Oh, I was thinking I could use my amiibo, which I haven't done. Why is it the striking? Ooh, ten arrows. Most inefficient shipping ever. <laughs> Yeah, that's true. Did it not let you do that in Breath of the Wild? What? Switch out uh, your weapon if your inventory is full. Um, I feel like it did, but no. Yeah, it didn't. Yeah, you had to. Yeah, you had to, it closed back up. You had to fix your inventory and then. Yeah. Oh, maybe that's. What yeah, I remember that now. Okay. Let's get our horse back. <laughs> no, it's exactly the same, Justin. You hear all the the music that's exactly the same. Mm. Even if it looks weak, a monster still a monster. You've always got to stay on your guard. Uh, I've got to give a, you a little something for saving me, right? Hope this helps. Oh, that's cool. Uh, the name's Kalissa. I'm a legendary treasure hunter of the Gerudo. Gerudo. Nice to meet you. Have you heard about the strange phenomena going on all over around the regions of Hyrule? Uh, Islands floating in the sky and caves opening up everywhere. It's a dream come true for a treasure hunter. Mm. As a legendary treasure hunter, I am more than happy to share some tips with you. The key to making new discoveries is being able to get somewhere high up. A cliff runs that cliff ruins that have fallen from the sky. As long as it's high up, it'll work just fine. Uh. So get high up and look around. You're bound to discover all kinds of things. I'd better get going. Hope 
meet again. Yeah, just like others, you struggle with change. <laughs> Oh no, choo choo jellies. Turn them to fire choo choos. <laughs> That's how to multiply your choo choo jellies right there. Thanks, Epona, for waiting for me. We're gonna head over to this shrine. Dazzle fruit. Razzle dazzle. I mean, they've definitely added a lot to the game, and if if you were a fan of Breath of the Wild, which I was, then this is this is a, a nice a nice change. My drumsticks on. One over there. They were kind of in shadow. Secrets. They say every cave has a secret. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to read it. Built to carry. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's up there. Okay. Watch that first step. It's a doozy. I'm just like, look, there's stairs. Um. I mean, how do they build these places? It's like the Empire in Star Wars. They just build these places with in endless pits. <laughs> Oh, I guess I could just jump. <laughs> I guess so. Interpreted there. Let's go. Let's -a go. Okay. Okay. That doesn't look too hard. I mean, considering I had to put them on balloons earlier. Okay. 
see. Okay, well that's not too hard. Not really spinning, but <laughs> it made it. Okay. A little bit harder. There is one. Uh, I don't know that I ever found this. One. Oh, you didn't find this one? You don't remember doing don't something remember like this? for this. this. I don't know if this is going to work, but... Oops. Oops. Look at that. Did you see? <laughs> I caught it before it fell off the, the edge. Still doesn't seem like a good idea. This does not seem like a good idea. This seem, does not seem very stable. Alright, what's over here? Oh, a chest. Seems structurally sound. <laughs> Another construct bow. Which, I guess I'll just get rid of the one I've been using. Alright. Now for the one I'm worried about. What if I did this? This is an interesting idea. I think I can do it, though. Because there's no way to kind of slide it on. 
But the only thing I can think of doing is doing this. So this seems like a bad idea. And we'll see. Oh my god, is it gonna work? It looks like it's gonna work. That shouldn't have worked. <laughs> I feel like that shouldn't have worked. <laughs> uh, well, it may weigh so much as long yeah, as it's yeah. Well, I mean, I put it right in the middle so that the, the weight would be balanced and all that stuff, so. <laughs> exactly. Forgetting I can <laughs> need to find a place where I can convert these into uh I'll probably be one in the village. Into hearts. Or I could go I could always warp back, I guess. I'll do that. It's raining. Oh no, you okay? Okay. Alright, so we, we can just go back to uh, Lookout Tower real quick. I actually can't even remember where exactly that shrine was. Thinking. Hey, Megan! Thank you! so much thanks for subscribing <laughs> how have you been doing it's been going okay i've been enjoying building things that's that's been my uh favorite part of this game has been the building part all right where was there was there's one in here somewhere is that hestu over there I thought he was going. I thought he was going the other direction. Did you run into him before? Oh, I've already, yeah, he's already done his new dance for me. <laughs> In fact, I don't think I have enough. I don't have any more seeds, so. I do have one. Sure. Uh, let's do the bow stash this time. <laughs> Dave the Diver, nice. Yeah, I've been watching. I watched Arcade Bear play Dave the Diver, and I watched um, Dance Gaming play play it. It looks pretty fun. Yeah, he's got helpers with his dance now. Although I kind of like his old dance. But I always love the little stuff coming out of coming out of his maracas. And I like how he says da 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 da. <laughs> Shagalaka. <laughs> I always thought it was weird that there was a dancing broccoli. Yeah, dancing broccoli. Yeah, I thought it was great. Are there? You know, are there? Um, has to like, I need like a has to plush for my couch. What? I need I need broccoli man for my couch. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Don't you have enough? No. My sofa back there has turned into a teenage girl's bedroom. All <laughs> I all we need is the like Lisa Frank unicorn hanging over it. <laughs> There it is. I knew it was down here. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, definitely heart container. Ah, I'm one off from getting another one. Oh well, it's fine. My heart! Alright. So let's go back to the shrine. Alright. Thanks for lurking and thanks for res and thanks for subbing. For playing. <laughs> yep. All right. It's still raining here, Epona. Was the Epona going like, where did he go? All right, we need to take a right turn. Oh, shit! <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to jump off. I'm now always worried that these uh, trees are going to come to life and get me. Oh, it's a sleeping dude. Whoa, 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 whoa. I keep hitting, I keep wanting to hit B to, to, to do whoa. And I, that makes me jump off. Is that just a windmill? What's it doing? Those wolves? Oh, it's raining. Gosh darn it. I'm gonna go where it's not raining. Did it stop? It stopped. Yeah. I mean, I guess this is the downside of being curious. Then you get you get kind of distracted and off the the path, and then you have to kind of get back on it. I'll I'll definitely say this game's a time vampire. I feel like I haven't played much of the game, and I mean we're already on the fourth stream. Now, the, uh, the second stream was teamed up with Shaq Fu, so there is a little bit of that, so. Wasn't a full stream. All right, let's get on. Let's get, get going. I wanna go this way. Great, yeah, we don't wanna go that way. 
we need I guess we need to cross this. Should we go maybe we should go down south. Maybe there's a way to cross it down south. It's still the tutorial level. <laughs> Like, why is that bat flying in? I like I like using their eyes for uh, attached to arrows. If you attach a wing, it'll make the arrow go far. It'll do what? A wing will make the arrow go farther ah i see the eye will like home in on something yep. yeah i know what an air, uh... yeah i i really don't like the way they can the enemies can pick up rocks and throw them at you where there are no rocks. <laughs> they just, they can naturally just get rocks. It's amazing that the stake landed on its edge. It makes me want to attach it to something. Can I put meat on the end of my torch? I mean, why would you? <laughs> it's not more of like, why would you? It's just because it's there. No, it is. I'm like, why do you do yeah. rock climbing? Because it's there. Shit. No, that's not the same. I gotta. I always gotta pick up the herb. Yeah. The high Hy Hylian herb. What is hilarious? You remember there was the kid on Twitter who was basically tracking all of Elon Musk's movements. Oh yeah, yeah. On airplanes. Yep. He got permanently banned from Twitter. Yeah. For doing it. Elon Musk bought it. He's moved it to Threads. Yeah. <laughs> Super spicy. Oh. Spicy. Uh, I will make some. What did it say? Oh. 
Punch up dishes. All right, well, we're, we're gonna try it and see what happens. No, it did shit. It did nothing. That that was like bad. I think the apples by themselves do more. Yeah, I know. I think it was supposed to be for monster meals. We'll make this one nutty. Sunny fried wild greens. Oh. Mm -hmm. So that will restore you yeah, from blood. I know, that's why I put it in there. Oh, look who it is. Yeah. <laughs> it's Beetle. In Breath of the Wild I used to try to attack him. <laughs> if you forgot, my beetle-shaped pack is right here to remind you. Wow! In this topsy-turvy world, there's only one direction to go, forward. So when I travel, it's forward all the way. I can sell you bugs of the highest quality, and if you need anything else on your life journey, I can sell you that too. Short on rupees? Don't worry, I'll buy anything you don't want weighing you down. <laughs> and what's better? Way... To lighten up that cell of your rocks, gemstones in particular, fetch a high price. Sa, sa. All right, uh, what have you got? It's always funny that he's got all that shit on his back. Has so he's few got, items. I mean, I've got all this shit. I don't need this. I just always buy the arrows. Yeah, I've got 115 arrows right now, so I'm like not. I'm curious what I did all this work for one of these opals. What? what 30? Really, it's not worth it. Um. Um. Just, uh, pointing something out. Yes. <laughs> the gems do things in this game. Ah, uh, okay. So don't necessarily go sell them right away. So read their descriptions carefully. Okay. It contains the power of water. Ah. All right, then. I'll take them. Oh. oh, do you need to speak with Banji? Apologies, we were caught up in our conversation. I'm from Rito Village in the Northwest. Uh. Times are tough where I'm from. Merchants aren't able to reach my village because of the blizzard. We're fortunate the kind folks from the stable are sharing their supplies with us. <laughs> it's thanks to them that the children still have full bellies. Uh. Don't mention it, really. The Rito have been good neighbors to us. We're just returning the favor. You let me know if there's anything else you need, all right? I can arrange to have it sent here and then pack it up for you to carry home. Uh. Words cannot express my gratitude. Uh. <sighs> Need supplies. Please take as much as you... Uh. We've kind of already expended that. Don't really need you. Oh, 
don't think I have oh. enough pony points. Oh. Um, you you can get those just for checking in in each stable. Ah, I see. Hmm? Is something bothering you, young man? Oh, could it be? Is this bright young fellow interested in the poster too? Reports say this is a picture of a beast that's been rumored to be lurking somewhere in Hyrule. Mm. It's been the talk of the stables. They say Princess Zelda herself was seen traveling with this beast. Look, look at those tusks. What a fearsome creature. I wonder where the beast is right now. Quite a mysterious, don't you think? <sighs> if I were younger, I'd hike all the way, hike all the stables to... I'd hike to all the stables to find out if there's any truth to these rumors. Ah. What's the lucky Clover Gazette covering in this edition? Oh. Great fairy fleas into flowery flower bud. Yikes, that doesn't sound good at all. A great fairy known as her love of music has hidden herself away in her flower bud. Nearby Woodland Stable is in a panic. Hmm, I've heard a rumor that a great fairy would sometimes offer a blessing to visiting travelers. I wonder going to the... Uh, I was going to head to Elden, the region in the northeast Hyrule, and I see it was true, but I always read every word of these newspapers. Ah, there goes Beetle. Whoa, 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 Out of Diet Coke. Let's do a. Uh, let's take a fries quest break. Exclamation mark! Join to begin. If you'd like to play fries quest, I figured out the problem, Neil. Uh, with the problem that happened last night. So when shipwreck typed in exclamation mark join. He accidentally replied to one of Gregel's messages. We're having a oh. special today. And so what I'm happened in it. the code? Hey Jamanzu. Jam an Uzu. <laughs> Welcome. So what you want to do is exclamation mark buy so you have 39 gold. So you want to do exclamation mark by W1 to get the stick. You could do that. I probably butchered your name. So let me know if, if, if I would the correct pronunciation. Or you could buy some armor. Actually, you don't have enough for the armor. Now you could buy a shield. A1. <laughs> you love the way people say it. Yeah. <laughs> so if you type any of those things, you'll yeah. If you if you type any of those things, you'll buy a stick, or you can just sit there and use your fists, and this will be interesting. Eric Greggles will come and help you too. Yeah. If anyone else played last game, uh, you can come in and and uh, and play as well. So basically, because Shipwreck replied, it used Shipwreck's name, but it used Greggles. Account. account and so they were both playing Gregel's account Backy. yeah so <laughs> hey speedo gangsta
I used to be an adventurer like you until I took an arrow in the knee. All right, here come the monsters. Good luck. <laughs> I'll see you in a second. Oh no, y'all all died. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Alright, you can you can rejoin in. I just got some chips. Buy something, will ya? Formulated my potions with 25% less lead. Ready for battle. Well, if you do ready, it'll just speed up the timer. It won't start. If there's eight players, then it will start. Ready for battle. Shops closed. Have fun counting sheep.
You won! Today only. 2% off when you spend 10,000 or more. Ready for action. Do what? If he does level up, it'll tell him if he needs fries, right? Yeah, if yeah. you do, yeah, if you do exclamation mark level up, it'll tell you. Yeah, you can do that at any time. Well, you still need experience points. Um, but you need... Uh, so if you're trying to get to level 10, you need 10 fries. So, so yeah, you're going to need 10 fries and that much experience points. Yep, one fry per level. But it's the level you're getting to. So like if you're trying to get to level 10, you need 10 fries. So Scorpio needs 16 fries to get to level 16. Ready for battle. Good luck. You'll certainly need it. Oh no, Scorpio! You can do it, Greggles! Uh-oh. Oh no! Can't oh! possibly pay me enough gold to clean this up! Oh, so close, so close. All right, let's cross the bridge. Huh. 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 
Worry, I'm just gonna go around it. Never have enough peppers. I'm sure they did this because, uh, You can, uh, cause we're, they said it's a blizzard up ahead, so. Yeah. I probably should have done more cold resistant, uh, Beetle should have had cold resistant stuff. Uh, well, there's 10 minutes, 30 seconds of my You probably will encounter more steak. cooking stations. Do what? You'll probably encounter more cooking stations, too. Oh, that's, that's fine. I was just, uh... Yep. I was just checking what I had. I wanted his arrows. That's when I should have put the eyeball on it.
kill it. <laughs> what is my wolf meat? Oh, bro, you're you're muted. I've always thought it was funny in this game that the prime meat is from a wolf. From wolves, yeah. of red choo-choo jellies. If you hit Y, it'll sort them. Yeah. Or the fireberry wool. There they are. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Things were looking a little dicey, but you pulled me out of the fire. Aww. As a chef, there's no better way for me to thank you than with food. I hope this tickles your taste buds. Deep fried drumstick. Oh. My name is Savory, of course. <laughs> I'm a traveling chef constantly on the lookout for the freshest ingredients the caves can offer. If you need to do some cooking yourself, you're welcome to use my pot. I'm not sure how else to repay you. Oh. Wait, maybe I'll do. I can share all that I've learned while going through the caves. Caves are full of valuable ingredients and ores. Think of them as Hyrule's natural treasure chests. Trust me, knowing your caves can be a major boon for travelers. Mm. To start, did you know that there's actually a cave right nearby? There's an opening in the ground north of us that leads into it. I didn't find many ingredients in there when I poked my head in but I did see a fair share of ore deposits. Oh. Break one of those with a hammer or something and you're in for a treat. There's a flint for some starting fires, rock salt for seasoning your cooking, and luminous stones and gems to sell for high prices. Ah. Around here, caves are the only place to find ore deposits too. If you find a cave, don't think twice about going oh. in. I hope our paths will cross again somewhere so long and safe travel. Good shield, though. Uh, let's see. Mm. 
cook some stuff since we're going into the cold. the rusty claymore. Oh, rusty claymore is not worth much. I don't know if that killed it or not. I saw the puff of smoke. You just found Hyrule's asshole. <laughs> Hyrulean asshole. It's got two of them. Wait, I'm sealed. I got a bomb flower. Yeah, I don't. Might have used them all up. It's really easy to get eye tracked in this game.
come down here to rescue me it's a rescue uh, why thank you i was heading to rito village which is suffering through a fierce blizzard to cheer them up with music and supplies i got my wagon going at a pretty good clip on this road but then i suddenly drove into this hole never been here before uh, the horse was riding ran off somewhere and my cargo has spoiled the only thing left is the wagon uh, i haven't figured out how to get both me and the wagon out of this hole and I won't leave it behind, which leaves me stuck here, plain and simple. Mm. I'm relieved that someone came to rescue me, but I hope I have a plan. Free me from this hole. Okay. Shouldn't seem too hard. You land the crate on another never burning. If you land the crate, what? If the crate hits another crate when you drop it, yeah, yeah. it will never break. Yeah. It's annoying. to fuse it to two places. Whatever. He's like, rescue me. Oh, shite. Hey. Keep, uh, You're mounted off now. Yeah, I know. It's it's annoying. Well, what I should have done is here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna unhook it. Oh, it unhooked everything.
Can't climb up the wall of this hole, and even if I could, I wouldn't want to leave without my wagon. Uh, if only someone could pull my wagon out of the hole. Okay. With you in it? Get in the wagon. What? If you can actually make this happen? Yeah. All right, then. Let's hope you won't know what you're doing. Well, I don't know if we know that. <laughs> I'm in the wagon, ready to go. <laughs> well, I'm just trying to get on top of the... Like, not being so dangerous. Should be able to just strike it. Yeah, I can't seem to get to the spot where I can strike it. That's what I'm trying to do. If it's not obvious. No, I think you can just strike the like the pole on the wagon. Oh. No. Oh. Maybe you just need to get on uh, the top. I'll get, I'll, I, I know what to do. Now I may have gotten, I may have tactically put this in the spot. <laughs> Good, I didn't have to land it. <laughs> Whew, I'm finally out. I got so nervous I fogged up my glasses and missed what you did. Uh, <laughs> but you did it. You actually did it. Thank you so much. If you had come, if you hadn't come along, I don't know how much longer I would have been stuck in that hole. Come to think of it, if I hadn't made such a rash decision during the earliest days of the upheaval and run off uh, out of my troop, maybe this wouldn't have ended up like this. I mean, the supplies I collected to help feed Rito Village have all spoiled by now anyway. Uh, I should get back to the stable trotters and rejoin my bandmates will do more good. Oh, have you not heard this? Us stable trotters are a music troupe that goes around stables to perform. If if I had to guess, it's out of your way, but they might be near Woodland Stable over in Elven. After I return to this wagon I borrowed, I'm going to rejoin the troupe. There are so many people who would benefit from us hearing oh. us play. Oh, one more thing. Take this, please. It's a cooking ingredient I picked up on my travels. This is the least I could do for getting me out of there. He gave me honeycomb. Yeah. <laughs> Seems like I it would have been better. All right, where's Epona? ride for very long before I get up and get and get stuff. I mean it's the herb. I gotta get the herb. The Hyru Hyrulean herb makes everything taste better. You do know you can't taste any of this stuff, right? <laughs> I can tell that uh, Link is that much happier. Oh, I see. Ha! 
the guy with the sign again. <laughs> oh, it's you. Thank you. Thank, thanks for your help earlier. I'm putting President Hudson here too, but I can't stand here forever. I've got so many more signs to spread around. I don't know what to do. Uh, let's see. I mean, it seems pretty easy. <laughs> But I can't use his. So, hmm. Although it looks like I did a pretty good job. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to do anything though. I can't, there's no way to like, uh, here, why don't we do this? Yeah, uh, at least. <laughs> the president standing ah! that was brilliant i would never have thought of it oh right let's get him secured while he's still standing With your help, President Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. It fills my heart with joy to see him doing so well on his own. Take this. <laughs> Ooh, spicy veggie rice balls. <laughs> ah! Whoa! He's like, no, we're not going faster. <laughs> Looks like the Borg are invading that mountain over there.
There you go, Your opponent almost killed him. I missed him. <laughs> A rock boomerang. <laughs> Look at all the fire fruit he had. I wish I could. Can I just? Uh oh, a fruit that grows in cold, snowy regions, known for its tangy, sweet flavor. It doesn't offer any special effects, but it's popular cooking ingredient. I thought they were fire. Maybe I saw those spicy ones. And Just a dream. Guess it's time to collect some wood. No, no kindling shortcuts. My Hylian prime pine cone mishap taught me that. Gotta do the work and chop down the trees. Hmm? Oh, welcome. This is Rito Stable. No, it's not. It's the Lucky Clover Gazette. I'm sorry. Old habits die hard. Harder than stables do, clearly. Um... I just do odd jobs, so if you have business with the Lucky Clover Gazette, please ask someone inside. Oh. Perhaps due to the abnormal weather, there's been an explosive increase in Hylian pine cones. <laughs> They're very oily on the inside and burn really well. Too well, in fact. I tried tossing one into the fire for kindling, and it went up so violently it created a whirlwind, uh. which in turn sent all of the f uh, freshly... Uh, printed newspapers flying far, far away. I'm supposed to be helping the Lucky Clover Gazette, and what was very much the opposite of help. Ah. Shh. Tracy. Our editor here is getting ready for our big Princess Zelda investigation. You're here about our newspaper, right? Then you can talk to me too. I'm next in charge. Ah. Oh, wait a minute. It's you. I gotta say, you did a good job getting out here to find us. It's quite a hike from Lookout Landing. When you haven't gotten wings, but here you are. Was it easy to find this place? Oh. Some folks pass by without a second look. After all, it was a stable until Tracy... Uh, cheated the previous owner out of it. But don't mind uh, miss a thing, do you? Not bad. Not bad at all. I assume you came for the job. You want to work for the newspaper, right? I'll vouch for you with Tracy. Oh. Just picture it. Traveling the world as a reporter, shining light on the truth. 
We'll be partners out there. Oh. Hey, quiet. Ah? Don't you listen, Pen. I told you I was busy, but you keep bothering me. And another thing, I bought this place from the owner after we came to a fair, mutually beneficial agreement. Could you stop telling people I cheated him out of it? Oh, oh sorry, Tracy. There's a new ap applicant for a reporter job I wanted you to know. Huh? New applicant? Yeah, I'm Link. I'm kind of with Zelda a lot. Hmm, hang on. You look like... Ah, uh? la, la. Hey, sorry, Pin. But could you give me and this guy a second here? <laughs> she knows who I am. Linus! <laughs> exactly. Uh. She seems like... Uh, I don't know. I don't trust her. <laughs> I don't trust her at all. All right, how about you give me the whole story, Link? I'm the editor of the Lucky Clover Gazette here, if you couldn't tell, so don't worry. I know everyone involved with this story. Pura asked us to help digging into what's happened to Princess Zelda. Now tell me everything. What exactly brought you here? Ah. Uh. Interesting. So that's why she's asked you to investigate places previously impacted by the upheaval. Uh. Well, coming here was a great call. What I mean is, we're getting tips from all over Hyrule. So many, in fact, that it's hard, been hard to keep up. And among those tips we've been hearing about, someone who looks like the princess appearing all sorts of places. Oh. I was about to sign Pin to chase those leads, but he could use a partner. I won't tell Pin who you are. It's better if no one knows you're involved. What do you say? Think you could work with him as we investigate? <laughs> Is that why people like anime? I, uh, I don't... I, I, maybe, Justin? <laughs> I would say Xenoblade was pretty anime, so... <laughs> Wait just a second. I'm going to go get you a little incentive from the back. <sighs> Here we go. <laughs> Ta-da! The full set of froggy armor. With that on, it's easy to cling to wet surfaces, no slipping. You work with Pen to chase down all these news stories, then I'll give you this armor. Oh, piece by piece, that's all yours. Ah. A pretty good deal there, Link. Anyway, that's my offer, hey. Pen. Pen, you can come back in. Why isn't he suspicious of why ah. he was asked to leave? Starting now, this guy's your partner. Huh. Well... If our editor here says you're in, then looks like he, I had you sized up right. Tracy knows how to pick them. Oh. All right, you two. Here's what you're going to do. Visit every stable for leads. Pen, you'll head this, uh, this all up. Stables bring people, and people bring details. And details are what we need. Now get me some news. <laughs> Oh. Okay, listen up, partner. We're on the trail of the truth about Princess Zelda. We can let even the smallest clue slip through our talons, or hands in your case. We should visit as many stables as we can. Travelers always have plenty of going-ons and talk about. So long! Epona. I don't think I have any more raw meat. Let's keep heading. Think. Look at the map. Okay, we need to go to Rito Village. I don't know. Okay, we need to go the other direction. Seems to me. Oh, unless it's... Hmm. Eh, let's keep going. What the fuck is that? 
I guess. stuff I can attach to. Can I chop that down? can cut down a tree. I, I already did. People get amazed when he blinks coming around and he's got <laughs> it's kind of overkill.
<laughs> oh well. Okay. We'll try this again. Oh, it moved it moved it out of the way. <laughs> He's like, why are you doing this to the president? <laughs> uh. mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it just completely fell over. Okay. All right. Why don't you put it in front of the sign? I did. That was the first thing I tried. <laughs> All right, let's try it again. And then I'll go get another tree. <laughs> I don't know. I thought it I thought it might work. <laughs> Good thing your opponent wasn't still there. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't it doesn't like it doesn't like when I do that. It's like this is too logical. Alright, there, let's do one more. This will work. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> You've never made me so happy that I ran past this guy every time I saw him. There, it's not moving now. Oh, it didn't attach. No, but it probably still won't move. There. I'm trying to let it go now. Ridiculous content Ridiculous. is what you're saying. It did. Yeah, he's standing. Oh, he's totally standing. <laughs> All right, let's get him secured. See, it works. <laughs> uh. I don't know if that was 20 rupees worth of work there. <laughs> hmm. A mushroom that spreads. This. Ah. All right. <laughs> uh oh, I like, I like how he set my contraption to the side there. I'm going to leave it there as a monument to innovation.
There's a cave. Yeah. Oh no, it's not a cave. Oh, this makes me nervous. Light range. Ebra mountain climbing path. that. That, uh, a little bit more. Do you have a shield? I do, and I'm using it, but they they can somehow get around it. Oh, if you have a two-handed weapon, it yeah. <laughs> equip this and then you need to feed yourself yeah <laughs> There is sometimes an interesting effect. 
with these constructs and monsters mm -hmm. is sometimes if you come into their view, like for you, you stay just far enough they can't see you, but you see them, they'll fight each other and one will kill the other off. Yeah, that's kind of what happened actually. But if you get involved with it, then they'll all come after you. Yeah, they they kind of uh, killed each other there. Oh, I guess it's good. one left over. Oh my goodness, he's 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 everywhere. That one was much easier. <laughs> Biting meaty rice balls. Those actually look pretty good. <laughs> it, would rub, it would tumble over. Yeah. Alright. 
Now what is going on over here? Or is this the beginning of the Rito village? Hey there. Are you here because you spotted the bonfires? The blizzard makes it hard to see where you're going, so we keep those bonfires going as a beacon for lost travelers. <laughs> they eat up a lot of firewood, but it's worth it. You can spot them even from up in the air. Though as, though as proud as I am of them, they can't beat the spotlights set up around that fancy Skyview Tower. Ah! It won't warm you up like a bonfire will, but it's hard to beat it for the size and sheer brightness. Oh. The Hylians are pretty incredible to have built something so impressive. Ah. We found these strange things at the foot of the uh, Hebra Mountains. They're oddly shaped, aren't they? Mm. I've done every test I can think of, but I haven't learned anything. Not even what they're made of or what they're for. All I know is that they're pretty heavy and pretty sharp. It'd probably hurt if you got hit by one of them, huh? Well, I've got all I'm going to get out of these things. If you want them, for some reason, they're all yours. Oh, they're horns. Take it all. I like how they react to uh, the things that you're doing. Aww. I'm waiting for Tulin. We were supposed to go looking for food together, but he's running late. I'll be still getting ready for Rito Village. I can wait a little longer. Ah. What possessed the Hylian to come out here? Don't act like you don't feel the weather. I can see you shivering inside. This isn't a good time to talk anyway. I was about to join... Uh... <laughs> Gassain? In the effort to scavenge for food. The longer the blizzard goes, the harder it gets. Just keep ourselves fed. Ah. I'm drawing up a special menu for those out scavenging for food or investigating. Ingredients are hard to come by in this blizzard, but we'll be fine if we get a little creative with our cooking. With the right ingredients, a little food can go a long way. For example, a pinch of spicy pepper warms you up, but you don't notice the cold as much. We do have many of them here, but you are welcome to what's available. In tough situations like this, everyone needs to cook out for each look out for each other and help where we can. Oh. Is that it is. Hey bud. I had heard you were missing, but here you are, looking perfectly healthy to me. Uh, Tiva was worried about you, you know. Have you been to see him yet? Ah. I'm tempted to go tell him the good news, but I'm all tied up at the moment. Eba should be in Rito Village, which is just south of here. I'm sure he'd be happy to get a visit from me. Uh, I don't think I have anything to cook. Oh, I do have some meat. Oh, shit. I ate it. <laughs> hey, now, Will. <laughs> I ate it. Ate it.
I think that was it. I think I used up all my meat. That. Oil. Hmm. That's probably how he made the, um, uh, the fried drumsticks. Tasha, how's it going? Good afternoon to you. Where I am. Watching some X Files, cool. Oh, I guess we don't see that. I'm just going to go up this path and see what I see. Oh look, there's a shrine. So I should probably head there. We're probably, it's, it's almost seven. It's probably time to start wrapping up the stream anyway. That, is that a person? Uh, looks, uh, look at this thing. What in the world coming to? What, what is the world coming to when something like this can be just fall from the sky? Mm. On top of which, the blizzard shows no sign of abating. So be careful when you travel these mountains. Look at that. job of just sitting here missing. Running low on bows. There's more. <laughs> oh, was that, uh, <laughs> is that, was that how you knew they were made in the lab is because they had no nipples? That's awesome. That was awesome. I love how he came flying by me.
it. Oh, there it is. That's what I was looking for. How do I get over there, though? Oh wait, there was a shrine I was heading for. Oh. oh. Where was that shrine? Oh, there it is. That was me being impatient right there. <laughs> I remember I remember when that happened. I, I don't think I was at the stream, but I remember you telling me about it. Without <laughs> He feels like you couldn't you couldn't uh, eat lunchables. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna go up this path and go to the shrine and then that's where we'll wrap up. Ah, maybe this way. I guess the snow pants have helped. I, ha I got I bought those snow pants at one point, and that's given me just enough cold resistance for this area. It's been going well. It's been going well. Uh. What a disaster. I came all this way to scrounge mushrooms and now this. I'll never get to the deep parts of this cave with a messed up wing. Yeah. Chill shrooms grow all over this cave, so I figured I'd be a prime spot for scavenging a little food. But cold water has built up here now, and I can't pick up any sh chill streams without crossing it. Ordinarily, my wings would take me right over a little pond like mm. this, but I hurt my wing in a small scrap with monsters, and I don't see how I can fly over the pond in this condition. The worst part is, I was just bragging to the folks in the village that I had bring back even more chill streams than last time. Mm. I don't come back with at least ten of them. There'll be an egg on my face. Okay. I think I may have. I don't know if I have 10 of them. Two. <laughs> is that what it is? Was the water too cold? It must be too cold. <laughs> it must be too cold. <laughs> I 
All right, I think this will be a good place to stop. I don't think... Oh, uh, yeah, technically I did do. Yeah, just death. It was a death. If it said game over, that was a death. <laughs> uh, well, thanks for hanging out with me this afternoon. I'll be back... Um, well, don't forget, on Tuesday I'm going to do a 12-hour stream. So I'll be uh, streaming during the day, which is unusual for me. <laughs> but I took, I took uh, a half a week off from work. And uh, I thought I'd use some of it to stream because it is my three year anniversary as an affiliate. And so that's what we'll be, I guess, celebrating by playing a lot more Breath of the Wild. <laughs> yeah, so Tuesday I'll do a 12 hour stream and just just playing just playing Tears of the Kingdom. So, hey, potential tadpole. No, that's perfectly fine. Lurking is great. <laughs> I like lurking. <laughs> Hi and bye. <laughs> Dino Chronicles speedrun. That would take much more than 12 hours. <laughs> As we discovered. Um, But otherwise, I'll be back Sunday night. I'll be back Sunday night. I'm going to do Monday night. Then I'm going to do Tuesday. And then I'm going to do Wednesday night. I'm, I'm just going to play do a lot of streaming this week. So. But I'm excited to, to, to play and celebrate. So. Um... Yeah, you know, as always, go over to YouTube. Follow me on YouTube as well. And thanks to all these subscribers. Uh, thank y'all so much for subscribing and, and helping to support the stream. Helps me so much in affording all these consoles and games, these stacks of games, subsidizing the stacks of games. <laughs> all right, there's our raid messages. Let me... Um, find someone we can hand everyone off to there you go I'm gonna copy copy it right now so I can da, da, da. I hate that the the title screen on Legend of Zelda has no music what's all that about <laughs> I, I, it happens to me all the time. It's really, I, I do not like it, but whatever. I think uh, we're going to go over to... Oh, it looks like Jor, Sofrika, and uh, It's JK are playing Mario Party Superstars together as part of Team Overture. So we're going to go uh, raid uh, It's JK. Beep, beep, beep. All right, there we go. Thank you again, everyone, for being here. I hope you have a great and wonderful weekend. Hope to see you back here tomorrow night at 9.30 p.m. Eastern uh, for more. Uh, I always want to say Breath of the Wild, T Tears of the Kingdom. That's been fun. <laughs> Stay safe, everyone. Be kind. <laughs> no, it, it, just, it does not make me nervous, but be kind. I did say be kind to one another, and that means between, yeah. But see, I know, Justin and Tesha, I know you're joking. I know that, I know. If it, if it wasn't, if you weren't joking, it would be quite awkward. But I, I know that y'all are joking. <laughs> All right. Bye. <laughs> I know the backstory. <laughs> <laughs>